changing perspective with a splash of paint. A local artist and the Juvenile Justice Center are teaming up. The A-Team's community reporter Lauren Wilson learned they're trying to close the gap between teens and law enforcement. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning. Yeah, that's right. Scary, threatening, out to get them. Those are just some of the thoughts that the kids in the I Care About My Life, I Care About Your Life program told me they felt about police in the past. But that is slowly starting to change thanks to one major art project. I really didn't like them. Now I kind of learned like it's protection, it's them protecting themselves. So I mean, it's not right, but at the end of the day, it's not wrong if they still get to go home to their families. Darjale Moore and the other kids in this group had to choose between the art project or juvenile detention. Every month they work with artist Ricky Lewis and spend time with a police officer, getting to know them and building a relationship. The kids brainstorm on how to create positive images about police and the community. Then they put their thoughts on a canvas. That painting eventually turns into a mural somewhere in Cleveland. Ricky Lewis is the artist leading the project. He says he hopes crime and violence can decrease. Uh, if they learn that these police officers are not out to get them, they may have a different response. There were a different response indeed. Now this is all part of a diversion program from the East Cleveland Neighborhood Center to encourage kids with misdemeanors not to be sentenced. The first mural has been completed and is sitting inside the East Cleveland Rec Center. For the E-Team, I'm Lauren Wilson. All right, Lauren, thank you.